You're listening. You're listening to the Morning Mayhem with Tyler and Mo. Z ninety seven five. All right, Mo. We're about to find out if you're rich or not. Okay. Spiritually. <laughs> oh yes, I'm. I feel like I'm spiritually. Well. You got hate in your heart. Let it out. <laughs> <laughs> White power. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Dave Chappelle's stand-up stuff or his his show. That was the best. Oh, man. So good. All right. Seriously, there is a uh, there's a way to find out if people are rich by the brands and products they own. Mm, and okay. it's kind of funny because they go back to like 92, mm-hmm. 1992, which is probably before some of y'all were born. Right. Uh, that if you own this it's a clear sign. And then, mm-hmm. obviously, we have today's. Uh, what if you, if, if you own this, then you're probably wealthy. Okay. You want to hear 1992 first? Yeah, let's let's hear 1992. D- d- find the top rock song in 1992 while I'm reading these. Okay. Uh, let's see. Owned an automatic dishwasher. If huh. you owned an automatic dishwasher, you were probably rich in 1992. Now it like comes standard in everybody's home. At right, our apartment. that's crazy. Uh, used dishwashing detergent, not just turned it on and let hot water spray everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, traveled domestically. I think that still kind of stands. If you traveled, you, you're you're kind of doing well for yourself. Mm-hmm. Like if you're going abroad. Like, a, check out me and my boo. We just went to Paris, and then we went over to Haiti to help out a bunch of. Unfortunate children. <laughs> unfortunate, <laughs> unfortunate children. <laughs> unfortunate. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> owned, um, a, owned a garage door opener. You were considered wealthy in 1992. Owned a fireplace. Owned a telephone answering machine. Huh. Boy, has that changed. Huh. Used dry cleaning services. Used overnight delivery service. Owned a garbage disposal. Boy, has that changed as well. Right. Um, but yeah, so that's it's. But the traveling was domestic and international, by the way. So okay, that was 1992. Here is the brands you owned in 1992 if you were rich. Gray Poupon. Uh, so you also bought Kodiak or Kodak. Kodak, not Kodak. Kodiak. No, there's no Kodiak. I. Well, this 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 font is really small. I can barely read it. Oh, okay. Uh, use Thomas, which is English muffin. Uh, some kind of detergent. Uh, Scotch Magic tape. These are brands that you, if you owned, you were probably rich. Cut right was was the wax paper. Philadelphia cream cheese. Mm-hmm. Uh, Hellman's main, mayonnaise. And a Sylvania TV set. Wow. Do you want to hear what it is like now? You are considered rich if you travel in the cotton, cotton, continental U, United States. Mm-hmm. You own a passport. Mm-hmm. You own a Bluetooth on vehicle. Mm-hmm. You own heated or cooled seats in a vehicle. Okay. Use dishwashing detergent. Who the hell doesn't use dishwashing detergent? Own, I don't know. I, own a dishwasher. <laughs> belong to a frequent flyer club. Yeah, now that one I can I can traveled outside the continental US, ordered in an item by internet. <laughs> that doesn't really take that much money. Ordered a plane ticket by internet. Mm-hmm. Here's the brands. Own an iPhone. Bull crap. Do you own an iPhone? No, hell no. iPhones suck. <laughs> Do you iPhones own, absolutely do, suck. Do you own an iPad? No, because Apple products in general suck. Do you use Verizon Wireless? I do have Verizon. All right. One out of I am a, I am a definitely a Verizon customer. Own an Android phone? Yes. I am team Android all the way. Use Kiko, Kikoman soy sauce. Kikoman. Kikoman. Yes, I, that is my favorite soy sauce, actually. All right. You're three out of five. Or six. Really? Three out of six. Oh, well. Or something. I don't you know. cheap bastards, get out of my way. <laughs> you own an H- Don't touch me, bitch. I'm rich. <laughs> you own an HP printer or a fax machine? I uh, do not. 
I have an HP laptop. <laughs> uh, I can't wait to take the kids and the family all over to uh, Colorado Springs. We're going to hit the Alps and uh, use AT&T. No, you own a Samsung TV set. I do have a Samsung TV at my home. Wow, uh, look at you. You're loaded. It's very nice, actually. Use Ziploc plastic bags. Absolutely. But every now and again, we get the off brands, you know, just to uh, help out the common folk. <laughs> it's it, This was based off a new study from the National Bureau of Economic Research that found the products and brands that are the best indicators of someone that is rich. You know, I just went down to the Swiss Alps and uh Oh ah. well I went to Aspen. Oh and I did you and I just spent fifty thousand dollars on a plane ticket. Oh well, my family and I we went over to Dubai and uh I rented the biggest Porsche they had to offer so we could actually borrow a giraffe from the zoo. <laughs> Porsche Smosh <laughs> I Got a Lambo. Oh, 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 I, I'd say, have you, have you had a Christmas gift buying party for your family yet? No, but I do give the homeless shelter my Range Rover. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh, I make, I make my cook prepare peanut butter and jelly sandwiches for all the homeless people all around my town, and I actually go out and hand deliver them myself with gloves on, though. <laughs> I can't touch the pole. Well, well, good for you because I take the fried chicken for all the darkies. <laughs> <laughs>